defending Olympic champions, the Soviet Union. With the Cold War at its height, it was an historic match. The Americans drew first blood. A 10,000 strong crowd packed the Blythe Arena, all hoping to witness a miracle on ice. The patchwork American collegiate team were trying to defy overwhelming odds. The scorer of the first American goal, Billy Cleary, and his brother Bob, had only joined the team two weeks before the games. The second goal was the result of another brotherly combination. Roger Christian passing to his brother Billy, who fired home the second American goal. The Americans defended in numbers. At the start of the third period, with the scores level on 2-2, the teams exchanged frequent scoring chances. But the two goalkeepers, Jack McCartan and Nikolai Pushkov, were up to the challenge. With the clock winding down, it became clear to everyone in the arena and those benefiting from live television coverage at home that the next goal would probably win the game. With just over five minutes left on the clock, Billy Christian slotted the puck past Pushkov. The United States led 3-2. The Soviets kept up the pressure in their attempt to claim an equalizing goal. But they were thwarted by goalkeeper Jack McCartan, who was the hero of the hour after making 27 saves. In a last-ditch effort, the Soviet team exchanged their goalkeeper for a sixth player. The Americans held on to win. The underdogs had beaten the defending Olympic champions for the first time in five years. The home crowd and the US players went wild. But America still had much to do to win gold. They faced Czechoslovakia in the final, but scored a convincing 9-4 victory to take the honours.